Man, this music's so good. How cute is this game? It's been a few days though. And by a few, I mean two since I played it. I was going to play it last night. <clears throat> but my parents had to get up so early this morning to get the uh, the plane that I didn't want to be shouting at all um, uh, all sorts of voice. I can't control my volume when I stream. And I didn't want to wake them up. So It is, isn't it? Caitlin, is this the first time you've seen it? Yeah, I'm not sure if I... I don't know if I like Link's new voice. Like, it sounds... I, the only thing I can... The only excuse I've got for it is if you hear it... It sounds like a little kid doing it. And the fact that this is kind of like a uh, diorama... It's got the kind of diorama look. It, it might be that... It's almost like a kid. Well, the fact that it's, they're talking about this whole island is imaginary. Maybe this is just a kid playing with uh, Zelda toys and is making his own sound effects. Which is why he sounds younger. I don't know. I'm making stuff up. I I, I did film studies. I had to um, I had to bullshit a lot. <laughs> That's my excuse. Uh, right, where were we? I, we got the... Um, what was the last thing we got? We got the harp, the surf harp. And the... I think, what did we get last? I think it was the hook shot, wasn't it? For that one. Yeah, it was. We got the hook shot. So there's a, there's a bunch of... Should be a bunch of new places we can get to. I think there's... Um, uh, the the whole sort of mountain range is now unlockable because I don't think I could get there before. And I think it's the only bit that I haven't actually explored yet. Uh, what did the owl say? <coughs> when fish sleeps uh, long and dreamily in the egg above, when you play the eight instruments of the sirens in front of the egg, he will awaken. This, my friend, is the only way for you to leave the island. Okay, that's not really that helpful, but... <clears throat> yeah, I'm pretty sure I've got to, got to explore up here now. So let's try and get up there. Bullshitting was your entire college career, Caitlin. It's, I think it's a good skill to have. As long as you don't use it um, too much in real life. I feel like that would be, uh, that'd be fairly, fairly bad times. <clears throat> I, know, I know a few people that are uh, massive bullshitters in real life. And it's very difficult to tell when they're actually telling the truth. And they don't I don't think they realise that we realise. Right, so we've got a Oh, there it is. Yes. Two kits two seconds in, I need this game. I've never played the other Zelda games. Uh, that's fine. That's the great thing about Zelda games. You, you don't need to have played any of the others, pretty much. The only exception would be... Um, possibly Breath of the Wild 2 when that comes out. I Maybe Majora's Mask? <clears throat> I actually... I Because I haven't played it. I'm not actually sure how much of uh, Majora's Mask actually links into Ocarina of Time. You're not a bullshitter in real life. You're an awful liar. I, I would, I would like to say the same. I, I'm not a. Um, apart from the occasional white lie to, to save someone um, some embarrassment or something like that. That's about all you'll get out of me. Let's put the uh, put the old hook shot on. I forget that I can actually use this as a weapon, can't I? Now... Yeah, let's try going this way. <clears throat> I know it's only been a couple of days, but I've kind of lost my, my bearings here. Oh yeah, there is one here. Um, how am I going to get that? Um, 
Um, let me try something here. That'd be a no. <laughs> oh my god. One a couple of days off and I already like sucking at this. Yeah, the problem is I can't I can't step on the um I can't step on those bits of floor. But yeah, that works. What about um there's got to be a reason that they let you go down here, down the bottom. <clears throat> I'm usually all right at seeing these kind of things, but I can't really, I can't really see this one. So I can pick up that skull, and we've got one gap in the middle there. Unless there's some other kind of item. Because how many items am I missing? Probably one. I, I'd imagine the other two spots at the bottom are for, uh, for jars again. Hmm. Yeah, because you can push that one up. Uh, that's fine. But the only one that I can safely push there... Ah, you know what? I, th I think I've got it. Possibly. Let me let me try something here. If I come out the other way again and reset it... I can push that that way. Um, I, I'm sh oh, I pressed the wrong button there. I was, I was going to say, I thought it blocked that. Yeah, see, the problem is this shit getting in the way. So I, I can push this one to the left. But I still can't move any of these ones. And I can't... Yeah, that that's... Oh, well, hang on. There you go. It was It was far more simple than I thought. I just couldn't see it. one of those instances where just doing it was uh, was better <clears throat> I just have a lot of problems like visualizing those kind of puzzles in my head for some reason oh there's another bit up here where did that come from how do you get in there hmm Ah, yeah, we've got this. There's a chest here as well. Now, how am I going to get across there, too? Oh, I could, yeah, I can just, um... I can just hookshot over here. Easy peasy. That was, I was kind of hoping for more. I guess we've got to do that. Oh. I'd say one of these is going to be letting me out, right? What's up, Mo? How you doing, dude? Oh, I wonder. I wonder if I should do that. Um, I'll tell you what. I'll try and do one of the um, dungeons today. But if I finish early, I'm going to try and uh, work on this. Um, swapping items quest. So we've still got tons of that to do, I think. I don't know how many items there are in, in that quest, but... Pretty good. How's the game treating you? Yeah, yeah, good, dude. I, I, haven't, I haven't been uh, playing for long. Only maybe 
about 10 minutes or so. Just trying to get my bearings again. See where I can uh, where I can go. Oh, there's another little hole there. The little sensor went off. Still not quite sure I'm getting the hang of this, how this uh, seashell sensor works. Because it pings, and then I dig everywhere, and it's nowhere to be found. Right, so that's no good. Yeah, see? Make mind up. How's uh, how's your day, Mo? Oh yeah, I think yeah, we can get across here now. That was the that was the main difference. Uh, let's go in that door first. Oh, all right. Oh, I wasn't actually expecting that to be there. I couldn't see it. see what do we have here right, so that's a way up let's just see if there's anything over here first Starting to get a bit of a mouth ulcer here, and it's uh, oh God, I hate, I hate them so much. It's only a tiny one. But it's already starting to feel a little bit sore. Hmm. Now, is that a hole that I can fall down? You are near the eagle's tower. Beware of the bird. Should I try it? I've got enough health. I just fuck it. I've, I've nearly dug this whole bit up. Let's let's keep doing it, just in case there is one here. Can you imagine trying to find these without without any help? Okay, so this is a, a secret hole. Oh. Oh, is this... Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Has that dropped me down? Oh, I hate this game so much, but I love it. It's a good job this map isn't very big. Otherwise, that would have been a lot more painful. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I mean that would that would have been a good way of finding that secret if I hadn't already found it. I'm not going to pick that up. The only thing about those I don't like those uh, picking up those power ups, only because I don't like the music as much as the actual game music. Right, back through here again. Let's change to the old uh, bookshop. Oh, fuck off, would you? Oh my god! Don't like the music. No, I like the music. I just, you know, the like power up music. You get when you get the uh, the acorn or the uh, the attack power one. Like my what it, it goes over the the actual music. Yeah, for a bit too long. I want I want to hear this music. Yeah, the pick the pickups one. Yeah. Okay, let's uh, let's continue over. Actually, yeah, what? 
Should we? Should I go back first? I'm actually. Yeah, I'm gonna go up here first. <laughs> See where this uh, ends up. Good, there's more of this. Um, what's over here first? I like that you can jump diagonally. Could you do that in the... Oh, what's the point in that? Is it just to show me that there's a key here? So that I have to, I have to do this. there's invisible shit there which I, I doubt there is is this another thing for magic no okay I guess I'm missing an item then I'll just put a little mark on this um, this door we'll come back to it later <coughs> Uh, actually, let's change it to change it to change it to treasure. All right, who is this? It's another Mario looker. Like, actually, looks like Luigi. This dude, doesn't he? Chickens these days don't have the fighting spirit they used to. In the old days, they could fly flap flap. But now, see? Cluck cluck. What? That's what he's going to say. Is that saying that the cuckoos in this one don't attack you? I like the music. Is it actually, is that meant to be Luigi? Because he looks taller. And he's wearing green, obviously. Because they did, uh, people were saying that there are a lot of uh, Mario things in this game. Uh, references. Really? Don't beep at me and then not give me anything. Unless, ah, uh, maybe it's this little, little spot here. Ah, alright. Never mind. It's probably a reference, so I don't remember him looking like that in the original. Yeah, I wonder if it actually is or not. Wow, that hookshot goes a long way. Secrets. Is this how I get that heart piece, maybe? Ah, oh, there's a... There's a bombable spot there. It's quite hard to make out unless uh, you're really looking at it properly. I love, I love that little jingle. Okay, that was take... Get, taking way too much damage here for no reason <clears throat> but yeah that's how you get to it so you should get our health back lovely we've only played the GB one not the GBC one I, I don't think it's that different though is it Mo? I, I don't know the exact differences between the Game Boy Color and the um, oh this seems pretty final if I go down here. The fact that it's shaped, it's shaped like a cross, does that mean it's like a grave or something? I'm just going to keep having a look up here for a sec. I want to see if there's a um, 
like another teleport spot with any luck. Oh, but that's also going to be final anyway, dropping down there. Okay, fuck it. Yeah, I don't know the exact differences between the, the two games. Apart from the colour dungeon, I guess. Mostly cosmetics, right. Have I been? I don't think I've been here before. Ah, no, I haven't. Do they have to have an area where fucking boulders drop on you? Every time. Uh, do, can I get in there? Those those rocks don't look blow upable to me. <coughs> what what are you what are you capering? There, young man. Ah, oh, there you go. Oh, look, there's a teleport point there. Just got to get to it somehow. Pushing me back as well. <laughs> okay. It's <laughs> another one to uh, to mark on the map then. Oh, all right. I think I should only need to get one more for another heart piece. <clears throat> now that's going to drop me down there, which is no good. Although I can't go back the way I came now because uh, because of that other area that I went into. Oh, that that bit that I dropped down to there was just here anyway. Oh, how the fuck do I get up there? Because it must be that, yeah, that that stairway must bring me up there, right? Ah, oh, shit, is that, I don't know if that's the way forward. And maybe that I'm just not thinking of the right thing. Or if I meant to go across here first. I reckon I've maybe got to go here first. It's mandatory to have an area of falling boulders and Zeldas, at least most of the 2D ones. Yeah, it does seem that way, doesn't it? Admittedly, I haven't played many of the 2D ones, but it certainly seems like that. Damn, okay. I guess I'm going to have to jump down and uh, make my way through again. And so let's talk to the old dude on the telephone, see if he can give us a hint. So we can know for sure. Mr. Ulrira. Have you been to the Face Shrine? It's north of Animal Village. That is a very interesting ruin click. Uh, didn't I do that? In there, I think. Ah, oh, I haven't been there, though. I don't think. Uh, let's put... Yeah, let's put a spot there, because I don't think I've been there yet. I'm just going to see if I can explore the rest of this area. What's up, Reese? 
Let myself play a bar on piano successfully three times before I could make tea and watch. Are you teaching yourself piano? Is this a recent, uh, recent thing? Recent. Oh my god, Mo! No! I've lost you to the puns. <laughs> You're sorry. I don't believe you. Not for a second. <laughs> that, was, that was quite a good one. I've got to hand it to you. Not really, kind of started on and off last year with Carl's Digital Piano. Got one for my birthday this year, sort of as a graduation present. That's cool, man. I've always wanted to play an instrument, but um, I'm very lazy. Shit balls. I think if I was to do a... If I was to pick an instrument to play it, it would be drums. I feel like drums would be quite satisfying. Or uh, uh, bass. I, li I, li I love the sound of uh, bass, like slap bass. But yeah, I'm. Uh, I've got too much entertainment c to consume to produce my own. I know it's a terrible excuse, but that's the one that you're getting. Right. So if I go up there. I can go across this way, see what's up there, if anything. I did go in that one, didn't I? Yeah. Really? Rude. <clears throat> you really wish you could learn piano, Caitlin? It's um Yeah, it's a nice it's a nice instrument, isn't it? I think I'd if I if I was to do piano it'd be for like synth wave. <laughs> be like one of those uh like painfully eighties dudes. Drums, I'm sure your neighbours will absolutely love this idea. Uh, it's we've got we live in a semi-detached mo, so we sh should be all right in that respect. It'd probably be more the people in the house that would be driven driven mental. Generally, I find the best way to learn instruments is not to go too hardcore with the practice. Always just kind of gone and played piano whenever I've grown tired of staring at a screen. Usually when I'm bored as fuck with work, right? Get yourself a cor uh, a Korg mini lot mini lo mini log. Korg mini log. Why? Why is that? Uh, is that drums? I know Cor I know Korg make instruments. Oh hello. I see what it's. I see what's going on. It's a bit antisocial. Wait, is that all there was there? That was that was just for a secret seashell. Yeah, because I can't jump over this. I, I like the fact that they've incorporated some Game Boy sounds into this soundtrack. It sounds really nice. Just the occasional Occasional Game Boy sound effect. <clears throat> okay, so up there took me to Oh yeah, upstairs again. Actually no, I didn't think I don't think I actually went up the, uh, the stairs, did I? I went and fell down that stupid hole like an idiot. Ooh. What's the bets that most of these are filled with uh, slimes? You 
bastards. Um, where am I going to want to push stuff here? Well, if I push that one down, and grab this one. Yeah, alright. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that didn't help. Okay, let's reset that. Oh, okay, so that even those reset. It sounds like there's someone in the other room. That's really scary. Maybe it's a ghost. Yeah, again, I can't I can't really see where to push here a lot of the time. Is that far left one going to be the only one that's actually got anything in it? Or is there some kind of thing here where I have to, I have to open all of them to get what's whatever goodies are inside? Or is it all, if they're just all trolls? <clears throat> this can't just be like five chests full of slimes, surely. I'll have a go at opening them all. I don't think there's any way to actually open them all, is there? Hang on. Push that up. Push that left. Push that left. <clears throat> no, I can, yeah. Just seems like it's only from one direction. 100 rupees, you're happy. Okay, I'm happy that it was a thing. And they don't come back either. That's not what I wanted to do. I really don't like these enemies. <clears throat> right, so rather than falling down the hole this time, let's go this way. Bat Central. There's there's so many little outcroppings here. I'm like, there's got to be some kind of secrets in there. Isn't there? But no, nope, it's just decoration. I thought I'd been here for a second. Right, so I should be able to uh, zip across there in a minute. Let's just see if there's anywhere else to go. How did you not fall off? How how are you not falling off? I think he's glitched. There you go. Let's put you out of your misery. <laughs> what? Oh, 
I like that even though they've made it 3D, they've made it so that the um, bombable walls are still fairly easy to see. Ooh. Alright, so we've got two fairies. I'm going to save those for absolute emergencies. And um, you know when that happens, I'm probably unlikely to ever use them. It's like saving all of those consumable items for a fight that never comes. Do it all the time. There's a lot of little, like, connectable caves here, isn't there? Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Bastard. Just got all my health back as well. Yeah, I wonder if that was that was maybe more something towards the limitations of the Game Boy. Perhaps. But they've obviously kept them in for, for the sake of uh, keeping it as close to the original as possible. Do I have this key? No. Fuck! That's that's the key at the other end. So how am I going to get past that fire? Because I need to get that and then... Yeah, the key... Oh, actually, yeah, the key was... Was it in there or it was... Was it in there? Maybe I should check this bit. Uh, what's the closest? Actually, how do I get across there again? I can swim, can't I? Yeah, let's try that. I don't think I've got enough seashells for the next bit, but I'll, uh, I might as well go and have a look while I'm here. Ba 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 ba. Actually, much closer than I thought I was going to be. Does it say how many? All right, so I've got twenty-five seashells so far. The the looks of that, it looks like they'd be about fifty. Actually, is that a drop there? No, oh, no, I'm alright. Yeah, how do I get in there? So there's another key there. I th do I have that key? So I'm sure I've got a key that I haven't used yet. It must be the face key, right? Yeah, because the bird key is the only one I don't have. So yeah, there's um, there's a there's a little door down here. Is it that I'm meant to use? Yeah, I don't think I could get past this before because I didn't have the flippers. Ah, oh, no, I didn't have the um, hook shot. That was it. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Urirara. So this must be the next dungeon, right? Nice. Level 6, the Face Shrine. Okay, cool. So we have got there. Uh, what have we got? We've got... Ooh, this music's nice. It's a bit moody. Two and a half hours until um, anime night. So I, I reckon that I'll probably be able to at least get this one done. 
Let's go left first. Ah, uh, we got you gotta have some mages, don't you? Wait, so I can't hit them? Can I stun them, maybe? Oh, you can lift them. Wait, what? Do I have to throw them onto these um, these things here? What the fuck is going on? Hello, Thomas. How you doing, dude? Let's go this way first. Fuck that. <laughs> What the fuck? Oh, we got a shy guy. Right, what's that gonna change? This, this must be, you know Plague was saying that there's gonna be a, uh, a certain dungeon that's gonna drive you mental. I reckon it's this one. Don't you think? Okay. Oh, arrows? If they're, if they're showing arrows there. Then maybe that's the way to defeat them. Right. I can't get through there. Can I chuck the bombs over that? Very nice music in this one. How are you today, Tom? Oof, this looks heavier than heavy. Your current strength won't cut it. Wait, so you can get another upgrade to your strength, really? Interesting. Let's go this way first. This looks like it's going to be quite a big old dungeon. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Give me the key. Uh, nothing else there. Nope. Well, good man. Tired. Drove to Norwich and back over the weekend. Uh, was that for like visiting someone? Also, uh, I don't suppose you're about Wednesday, are you, Tom? I'm going out for a drink, and I thought uh, I thought I'd invite you. You've got to throw a pot in here. 
How does that work? Because I don't think I can... I can't carry them through doors, can I? I got the beak! Uh, okay. I need to figure out... Um, oh, now that I know how to get through that other room, room with the wizards... Is there anything in here? Yes. That really went over its head. Oh, I might have to use a bomb again. that one. I feel like um, I'm, I'm a little bit better suited to doing these now because of the training I had with um, Link to the Past. With some of the kind of obscure retro game bullshit that was going on. <laughs> some of it. Fuck me, this is a big dungeon. The yeah, Antifax just moved there. And yes, about Wednesday. Cool. Um, yeah, we're going to go to the pub at about five o'clock. Um, I just, I suppose, yeah, just uh, toddle along once you're done with uh, work, I guess. If you'd like to, Thomas. You realise we should finish Demon Slayer this week. Did we watch? Wait, was it tw episode twenty-five we watched last week? Please, hope, can I try to check these over? Yeah, okay, cool. I guess this, this could become a bit of a nightmare if I run out of uh, bombs and shit. Ah, uh, they are going to give me more. It's tonight, Reese. I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop at around 8 o'clock to, uh, to do that. I guess I've got to make a pattern in here, do I? Or is there no... I was going to say, there can't be no no point to it, right? I'm not sure why it uh, made me light it up, though. <clears throat> Unless... Do those markings on the floor relate to something? Like maybe a... There could be like an invisible floor bit, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, that's fine, Tom. Yeah, uh, Lockhart. Thought I was moving it to Wednesday. No, no, no. No, I'm not doing it on my day off now. Oh, all right. And you can't hit those things. It. Oh, you fucking prick. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm gonna. This is the dungeon, isn't it? This is the annoying one. Alright, so that's. That's gotta be blue to get through that. at the same time I can't it can't be that one because I've got to I won't be able to get back through what's up here demon Slayer comes out on Tuesdays right okay I, I thought it was uh weekends for some reason but then I kind of just assume that most anime is on weekends enter the space where the eyes have walls the space where the eyes have walls. A 
Okay. Hopefully that will make itself more obvious. Yeah, so I've, there's, oh, there's another pot thing there. Another pot door. Oh, I could do that. And then do it. I, I want to go down and check that other door out first, though, before I progress any further. Because there's a couple of uh, chests there. Oh, I'm only going to be able to get one, though. Glorious. We get to hear that noise again. It is Saturdays. Okay. Yeah, I just, I don't know. I assume most, most big anime come out on Saturdays for some reason. Uh, I'm wondering if I should go to the right first. I should be able to get through that underground bit now. Yeah, I'm going to go right first. Considering I'm nearly out of uh, health, I'm going to probably die and then end up back at the beginning anyway. So, Oh, good. This is going to be nice. Oh, that, that actually wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Oh, no, not the tiles. Can I actually block them? Oh, I can just block. All right, that's way better. Way better. You, I don't remember being able to block them in Link to the Past. Right, so we've got uh, more pot doors. There's, there's a lot of these pot doors with no actual pots in the room, so I can only assume that you chuck these at them instead. Ow! Can you deflect that? I might as well try now. Yeah, okay. It's gonna be the red thing on the back of its head. I feel like playing. Ah, uh, oh, maybe I'll have to use the hook shot on that. Unless I'm meant to pick up the ball and chuck it back at it, maybe. Man, this music's well good. Very different from a Zelda, like what I expect from a Zelda. Soundtrack. Okay, let's try that again. Go on then. Ah, okay, there you go. It's like barking like a dog, so it wants to play fetch. Woo woo! See? It's not so nice now, is it, when someone does it to you? Right, 
Wonderful. That's exactly what I wanted. Why is it not marking that on the map? That area? That's kind of odd, isn't it? This has put us back there. Ah, oh, what was it the... Um... What was it the owl said? Because it says the room that has eyes. He balls up. I don't think I can get any further there until I um, get whatever the other gauntlet is. I assume there's another like power gauntlet of some kind. Don't you have all the hints in your menu? Um, I don't know if I have those ones or not. No. Because that's just the normal owl speech. Uh, okay. I'll, I'll go back and check that out. Because I need to go up this way anyway. Wow! Arseholes. Right, let's... Um, I think I need those up, don't I? this bit. Yeah, so enter the space where the eyes have walls. Try going this way first. Do, do, do. Is this going to be the item? You got a more powerful bracelet. You feel like you could lift an elephant. That's very specific, game. No problem. Usual saying is the walls have eyes. So are Mario and Zelda set in the same universe? I de yeah, I doubt it. I think Hyrule is its own own thing, isn't it? Right, let's try going... I'll try going back to that room. Now that I can lift the... Uh, lift those elephant statues. Fuck, nearly dead though. Reckon it's just that. Uh, I might die here. Or not. <laughs> I should have just stayed in one corner and blocked. I was trying to get to a safe spot. 
Why are they Goombas and Shy Guys then? Um, they just they just put it in as references. Oh, there's a good reason for it. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Oh shit, let me press that. Uh, not gonna lie, the giant egg on the island doesn't half look like the egg from Yoshi's Island, but I've never seen this game, so that's just speculation. I mean, it only really looks like the one in Yoshi's Island so much as it's an egg. I don't think it looks that similar otherwise, does it? Maybe the... Maybe the sort of spots, the colouring on it. Shit, okay, can't be that corner. Let's go down here. Why is there a blue mark on the floor? Unless that's where the item is gonna come from. Can you use the hookshot on it? No. Uh, we've got a door down below. Let's go this way first. Alright, so you're giving me more bombs. Now, can that open this? Yes. So that just means throwable object. Now, what are these all about? Ah. Uh... getting something wrong here. I don't think I can just drop them, can I? Doesn't appear to be a, a not, like, a non... Doesn't Yeah, it doesn't appear to be a way to just not throw them. The only pattern I'm seeing is that, um, do you notice that they, they always fall in a block? This could be the room with the, um, with the eyes as walls, maybe. Maybe they always make night moves. No. So I'm thinking, look, you see these ones have got like white blocks next to them and these ones have black ones. I guess I'm guessing I've got to try and get it to fall on that. Or does it make uh, night moves every time? I don't know, because it is, it is going that way, but... Oh, I didn't say you're overthinking it. That's, that's uh, unlike me. It was. Hang on, how did I do that, though? Was it because I stood on a black one at first and then a white one on the other one? <laughs> I don't know. What's up, uh, Rob? Imagine streaming at a normal time, eh? Yeah, I know, right? It's weird, isn't it? 
It's yeah, it's going good, uh, Rob. How are you doing? It yeah, it does go in L shapes like a knight, but it wasn't. It's meant to be like three across, three across, one up, wasn't it? And I don't think it was doing that every time. Like that time when I threw the white one, I was standing here, so it went four across and one up. I don't know, I did it anyway. <laughs> I did it! Ah, git. So, it's got caught in the rain, nearly ran over a swan. All good, though. Uh, I mean, swans are, like, pretty much pricks though aren't they so I don't think anyone really actually isn't it is a uh, isn't it killing a swan is treason or is that just one of the queen swans oh, I totally missed bombs it is then Bomber man, just trap him in there. Queen owns all the swans. You can get arrested. Yeah, I thought it was treason at one point, wasn't it? Then it's treason. Oh god, how how the fuck do you get through this room without getting hurt? Um, what's this bullshit? I'm dead! <laughs> um, maybe there's a way to push the blocks to block them. Oh man, I need some chocolate. But it's like super far away. Um, I wonder if there's still something to do with that, that room and this. This. Okay, um... Why was I getting stuck up here again? Oh yeah, it was because I couldn't throw the elephants. Let's go and see what's up there. Yeah, what what's that quote from again? It's treason then. I'm sure I watched it the other day and I can't think what it is. Oh, I didn't actually get in there, did I? Uh, by prerogative right, the British Crown enjoys ownership of all unmarked mute swans in open water. Rights over swans may uh, be granted to a subject by the Crown. Accordingly, they may also be claimed by prescription. Wait, what? You go, go down the um, just go down the chemist and ask for a um, a swan. <laughs> You totally eat a swan, though. What do you reckon they taste like? Chicken? Uh, how am I going to do this again? Wait, how did I get through there before? As the orange was up. Oh, it was that, wasn't it? No. How fuck? Wait, how did I get through there again? Can I just jump off the side? Oh no, that was it. The um, the the door. I opened the door with the switch before. No, actually, that doesn't make any sense. I don't know. Probably like duck, but bigger. 
pheasant? I don't know, I've, I've not had pheasant before. That seems like the most British bird you could uh, possibly eat. Apart from a goose, maybe. I'm taking a lot of stupid damage here. Um... Oh, actually, that was the problem, wasn't it? Can these things just not come back, please? They're really quite annoying. Okay, so we've got more moves here. Let's let's see how this actually works then. So does it? So I think you just have to be standing on a black tile within roughly the amount of moves that it has to be. Because it moves, it moves like a knight. Um, oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Moves like a knight, but at the same time, it. I think that's the wrong way around, by the way. But it 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 the the. Uh, it travels as many as it needs to um, left and then only one vertically so hang on let's plant that there a minute so if I, let's try this here or well, does one go hang on so if I try standing here no What's the pattern? Seems like one of them goes up and the other one goes down. It's like, you see, like, you see this? It's trying to go down. Rather than up. You're from the countryside, game pie was the shit. Oh, okay. Well. Apparently they don't taste uh, very good, if the internet can be believed. What, goose? No. I think they'll uh, only land on a square of their colour. You can determine that by the checker pattern. I don't know, it seems to want to, like, every time we, I, I push it down here, it wants to drift. But if I chuck it here, see, it wants to go up again. I don't know which way round is the right way here, though. Like, is that correct, or is there meant to be something in here? Alright. That I wasn't expecting to come out here. <laughs> I've still got all of this, all of these bits. I wonder if they're part of the dungeon. Because one is black and one is white. White goes to white, black goes to black. It, it doesn't seem to be working like that though. Because if I stand on white here, it goes to white. Right. But then if I stand on white here, hang on. Let's just chuck that there. Like in that in that in that theory, then that should go there when I throw it from a black one, right? But it doesn't. I don't know if this is meant to do something. Oh no, look, the, that, this one's surrounded by white, whereas this one's surrounded by black. So I assume that the right way round is that one's black and the other one's white. Maybe if I, can I jump into here and change this? Maybe it's got something to do with that, if I throw it from a different angle here. Come on. 
They do alternate, but look, these ones are surrounded by white ones. And this one's surrounded by black. So I don't know if I just got it right to begin with, or, or what, but... Because it doesn't seem to do anything in here. But that doesn't necessarily mean it hasn't changed something else. I guess I'll just have to look. And why see why would they give you a switch in here? Unless there was a reason for it. There's a lot of mystery going on here. I can't remember which uh, when I go down that passage there as well, which way I actually want to go. Ah, oh, shit. I can't remember. So, oh. Yeah, so I wonder if that actually changed anything. Hell, yeah, this 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 must be the one that Plague was talking about. Because this is annoying as fuck. This uh, this one. <laughs> I mean, maybe, but wouldn't this be another colour exclusive dungeon? Uh, I don't think it is. Because this is an actual... It seems like it's a, a proper... Oh, shit, that just bring, brings me back there. How do I get back to that other bit? I think it was a long... Oh, it's, it's down there, isn't it? I think I might have to die here. Just get my health back. Yeah, no, this is this is an actual dungeon because I had to use a key to get into it. Plus, it's going to have uh, an instrument in it. Oh, you start me here. Great. Let's go. I still haven't gone. There's a little door to the right there. Let's try that. Bin those off. Oh, great. Is there a better way of killing these things than using a ton of arrows? I guess it's giving me ten arrows, so it's kind of it's kind of all right. Oh, 
hop on the top of the crystals to move forward. Um, but hang on, there's no way to change it back to the other colour. Not here, at least. So it looks like I'm going to have to... Yeah, change it for, to orange. Jump on top of those crystals to jump across. Oh, but then we've got this, like... That fucking thing there. How am I going to get across that? I have to keep going back and forth, aren't I, to try and, uh, look, there's that. Ah, uh, look, I can, if I go the other way, through there, and come out there, I should be able to go down and then change that. And get through to that bit. Fuck off, cunts. Odd question, but for tile-based strategies, what shape tiles do you like the most? Uh, wait, how do you mean? Tile-based strategies. that thing again? Was it bombs? Or have I just got to lure all the enemies out? I think that's it, isn't it? Yeah. I'm sure I had to destroy, I had to destroy the repelling one, didn't I? Now we've got these laser pricks. I don't think this is going to end too well. Should have uh, should have blocked that. Yeah, Reese, what do you mean? Tile-based strategies. There isn't a terribly huge variety. You have squares or hexagons. Or am I misunderstanding the question? Yeah, I'm, I. What? Yeah. What do you mean? Like strategy games? Oh, okay. Strategy games where you move between tiles. Um. I don't know really. I don't think I've played enough of. Well, I say I don't think I've played enough of. I don't think I've played any games of hexagon-based strategy apart from. Uh, there was a board game that I played. I forget the name of it. Is it Carcassonne? Or however you say it. I think I might have played that one. But yeah, generally the only strategy game um, games that I played have generally been in squares. You know, like Fire Emblem or um, Advance Wars or Shining Force, that kind of thing. Carcassonne is squares. Uh, it wasn't that then. I played something with... Um, uh, something with hexagons. But I can't remember what board game it was. Catan? It could be. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not entirely sure.
Let's try that again, shall we? Yes, can I block the shot from that? I think I just got to do it without uh It's locked. You can open the door with the nightmare key. Oh shit, I've just gone to, got to the boss door. Ah, oh, I should have been looking where I was going. I thought it was over here. Um, how the fuck do you get back to Wait, is it this one brings me across here? Must be, right? <laughs> Civ has hexagons too. Yeah, I've not really played um, any of Civ. In fact, I, I, the only Civ game I played even a little bit of was Civilization Revolution on the the 360, I think. But I didn't. I played it for about five or ten minutes because I could see that it was going to be crack. Uh, yeah, it didn't go down last time, did I? Oh no, not you, assholes again. You're creepy. Oh yeah, I guess I got I think I got old alternate between them. That wasn't so bad. Right, so is that that's just is this just another way through? Or is there anything up here? No, just another way back, I think. Those be these beings from another dimension are awfully caring sharing, huh? How, in what way? Apart from sharing their creepy bullshit. Right, so we've got another place we can change the uh, the doodars here. Nothing in this. All right. That won't open. To open a treasure chest, use the pots around it. Fucking prick. You fucking pricks! I can't get back across either. I'm going to have to go all the way back out of this room and round. Ah! At the very least, I can get that, uh, that other bit done. What a troll game! <laughs> Super troll game. I hate that room so much.
is how am I going to get past this? Oh, you can jump over them, alright. You found some secret medicine. Apply it and see what happens. Wait, is that, um, like, Thingy's secret medicine? Tracy special medicine guaranteed to kickstart your heart. So that just gives me an automatic uh, extra life, doesn't it? Refusing to eat until the other one has had their share. Ah, okay. I see what you mean. Yeah. I mean, it, it would be more caring and sharing if they, like, kind of communicate to each other that eating bombs is bad for you. But, sure. I keep forgetting which staircase takes me where. <laughs> so I think I need to go back up through there. I'm sure for them it's just the equivalent of spicy curry. How? Wait, Cerise, are you telling me that whenever you have... Um three curries, you just explode and die. That's really inconvenient. certainly feel like you want to sometimes. <laughs> Wait, so you've, you've actually done that? You've, you've had three curries before in a row? Yeah. Oh, you know yeah. what? I've just realised, like, when I get that, whatever's in that chest, I'm going to have to go around yet again. So maybe I should go up here first, because that's going to be the boss key, right? Then again... I don't think there's any other locked doors, so what, why would it give me another key? No, I'm going to get it. Oh. Okay, so that's the boss key. So then what the fuck's in the other thing? Just realised, do you reckon I could make that jump? I guess not. How's it going, Fang? All good here, thank you. Ah, oh, well, it was going good. Until uh, that happened. Yeah, all gravy here. Thank you for the host. You actually sort of have had three curries, Reese. Place in Birmingham where you get unlimited Indian dishes for 10 quid. You nearly killed yourself with that. I still think there's 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 something to do with those um, those chess pieces. I'm convinced. I, I need to check what's up the top there. Is it what could it be? It's not it's not an item for in the um, in here. So it's either rupees or a new item. Maybe a, maybe another jar. You running around one heart is stressing me out. Yeah, it's all right. I, I, the, the, it doesn't really punish you a lot for dying. So that's kind of why I'm doing it. Mart! How are you doing? Hello there. 
Oh, Reese, thanks for giving me Fang a shout out, by the way. And and Mart as well, thank you. Mart, you still on? Oh, wow! You're playing Darksiders, the first one, right? John and Jay, how you doing? Guys, thank you, uh, thank you so much for the uh, for the raid, Mark. That was uh, super kind of you. My name is Sound Shower. You can call me Tom. I'm 33 short. Lots of games. Uh, I have lots of games. Sorry, I, I'm not. I'm not lots of games. And I'm really bad at sh uh, small talk, um, ironically. So um, yeah, just just ask me questions and just talk at me, and I'll, I'll respond. <laughs> Uh, John, thank you so much for the uh, the follow there. Oh, we got Thor here as well. Hi, Thor. Reese, can you give uh, Ormo? Could you give Thor a shout out too? I wanted to ask you going to Twitch London. Yes, I am. Yeah, are you? And Jay, thank you for the follow. He's lying. Tom is lots of games. Yeah, I'm just made entirely of games. Got me here too. Lord. Lord Ike. How's it going? Good to see you. You're both going? Yeah, I'm going with um, I'm going with R. Howard and uh, Gold Carrot. So we should all arrange to meet. I'm the pile of shame. You're you're such a cheeky fucker you are sometimes, Reese. <coughs> oh, excuse me. You asking questions is dangerous. I have the right to refuse to answer them. <laughs> you just wanted to see Sonic. You another Sonic fan, Jay. Thank you. Wow, three bless yous. Wait, so you got one which stops me from going to hell. Another one which cancels it out so I go to hell. And then another one which makes me... Yeah, so we're good, I think. If it was four, I would have been going to hell there. Um, Mark, how are you getting on with um, Darksiders? Because I really like the first one. Do you not think it feels like it's a Zelda game? Really like it. I do. War, War's quite a good character as well. We might die here, by the way. Uh, especially in this next room, because I'm not really sure how to traverse it. Oh, can I, if I just leave the... If I just, yeah, if I just leave the pots there, does that work? Or can I jump over these things? It's God of War Cross with Zelda, yeah. Yeah, pretty much. My mum always used to say that if you say thank you to someone who says bless you when you sneeze, a fairy dies. Yeah, I don't know either. I don't know. Hi, Sarah. Where are you three noodles going? Uh, Twitch London. Uh, which is free, which is good because I'm poor. Uh, <laughs> I'd love to go to Twitch uh, America, but monies. Thank you for the shout out, for Sarah Reese. Bloody fairies. I've, I've got two of them at the moment. Set it free and it will heal you. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to get through here without taking damage. Unless there's a way to deal with these things that I just don't know about. I can only think that I can jump over them. Okay, you can. Right, that, 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 that would have been something that I should have learned a long time ago but didn't. Because, dumb. We got our secret medicine. Right, so what is this item? Okay, we got another one of these. See what I mean? It's um, it really wants to go. They they want to go sort of certain ways here. Don't want to waste the bomb. I think if I stand. Yeah. 
See, that one wants to go upwards when you throw it. I'm sure. See what I mean? Doesn't matter where I throw it from, it wants to go upwards. <clears throat> That's happened again already. Didn't that just happen? Uh, yeah, they have two. They have a summer and a winter, by the looks of it. It's the first cons I'm super excited. It's, uh, Mark, I would, um, the only thing I'd say is maybe temper your expectations slightly because it's, the first one, uh, we didn't, re we didn't really enjoy because it was, uh, I don't know, it's, it's more of a, it's more of a, like, socializing with streamers, you know, kind of, it's almost like a networking event in that respect, uh, with, with, with some music that I didn't really get on with. <laughs> But once once I realised for the second one that if I... Because I'm not very good at just approaching people and just talking to them. Uh, when I got a bit of liquid courage in me, that, that helped. <laughs> that, that made it more fun at that point. Oh god, Cosmo and Wanda. We, we're going into... We're, we're talking about cartoon, old cartoons now, John. This one should be similar to the first one, to be fair. It, it's set in a different place, though. It seems like a better a better venue. It's closer to the tube station as well. You're good at networking, Mark. I'm really bad at it. I, I don't like to bother people. Yeah, I don't want to miss my train this time, either. Ne nearly missed it last time. Carl had to pull the train doors back open, really? I didn't hear about that. Yeah, it's connected to Waterloo, that's it. It's like underneath the station, isn't it? I think. I Sarah, I'm like you. I, I'd like... I think once I get into it, I'm alright. But I, I'm not very good at just approaching people. Randomly. Yo, 300 rupees. There you go. So if we do that... Oh no, hang on. Wait, what is with this one? It just wants to do the opposite. See, when I, when I seem to throw it on one side of the room, it wants to go up, and any the other one, it wants to go down. Maybe this is where I've got to throw it, like, from down here. Or if I try and throw it, like, this way. Fucking weird. Stick with me, guys. I'll honestly talk to anyone. All right, Mark. You're on. <laughs> Big Yikes missing a train. Yeah, nearly. I, I nearly missed the train on the first one. I literally got there as the doors were closing. And then these guys missed it for nearly a sip of the second time. I think it's in the station building, but on the outside, looking at it on the map. Yeah, from what I saw, I only looked at it briefly, but you kind of come out the station, go round, and then it's like sort of around the back here, isn't it? Because you're throwing it at a white tile. I'm, I'm sort of like judging it based on where I'm standing, though. See, look, I'm throwing it at a black tile. It doesn't matter. I don't even know if this must do something somewhere so I have to do it now you're going for a long weekend Friday to Monday so you intend to have a fair few drinks and get merry I, I'm up for drinks I'm ho hoping the drinks will be a bit cheaper there this time because they were you only got like a tiny little can for like five quid last time which is ridiculous 
Might have to go and find a pub nearby if it's too expensive. Get a bit merry before we go in. No, that's that's true, but you, you would at least get like a pint for five or six quid. Not not a small tiny can for five or six quid. Yeah. Cheap pub then go in. Not get don't get like obliterated though, because I think they um I think they stop people from going in if you're um if you're too drunk. Um, I need some chocolate. Give me a sec. What shall I have? Oh! Yes. I'll tell you what. Let's be adventurous. I'm going to have two chocolates because I'm, uh, I'm quite hungry. Yeah, the, what the rule about going out and then coming back in again, Reese. So we should probably... Like, like the Mart saying, we should drink out outside, go in, and then just stay in. <coughs> what happens at nine? Yeah, that's, that's it. Yeah, London prices are ridiculous. So um, I've got a dark chocolate Kit Kat, which we'll have first, and then I've got a penguin, so I can tell you guys a penguin joke. Wait, seven bucks for a can? Really? Jesus. Dude, dark chocolate's good up to a certain point. Love a Kit Kat. I still haven't tried any of those new flavours of Kit Kats yet. Yeah, that's that was that was bad planning on their behalf. Guys at the gate said we could get back in, but wouldn't let us back in after that. Everyone likes a Kit Kat. Oh yeah, John. Yeah, dude, don't worry. Um, sporting events over here charge um, an arm and a leg for a drink as well. They are pretty perfect, I'm not going to lie. Right, so we got a penguin. Um, <clears throat> just in case you don't haven't seen a penguin before, if you're outside the UK, these are chocolates with really bad jokes on the back of them. So I'm going to read it out for you now. Uh, why are penguins good racing car drivers? Because they are always in pole position. Yeah, that's it, Mo. I mean, um, actually, um, down where I live, it's still quite expensive. Uh, generally looking at about... Maybe about four, four pounds a pint. But it's at least a whole pint. If you guys in America are getting, like, a fucking bottle for that much, that's ridiculous. You'll just get a bottle of wine. Ah, uh, see, wine, wine's not for Thomas. Eight to ten dollars a pint, Sarah. Holy shit! I'm not gonna get drunk. It. Oh, no, I could still get drunk in America because I. It only takes a couple of pints to get me drunk. You'll talk to absolutely anyone then. You mean anyone? <laughs> Yeah, I'm not. Uh, no wine for me, just cider. Hmm. Does that work? Don't know if you have to, like, throw it. Are you serious? Down with cider too. Yeah, cider's the only thing I'll drink, really. 
Man, I'm not getting this. At all. Can someone tell me if I'm missing something here? I'm not, yeah, I'm not, I'm not do, doing moonshine. <laughs> what I need is to get good. I'm just disappointed now. I've never tried moonshine, but it, it just sounds like paint stripper to me. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I'm really not sure. But then, what can I do with this? I can't take it out of the room, can I? Look, I can't even get out of the room. So I have to, I have to solve this. The room is locked. Is that that? Maybe that's what it was. I, ha I had to do it to get out of the room. jump diagonally, doesn't it? If I throw it that way then. That's so weird. That's so weird. Right? I mean, I could have actually ported out as well. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> uh, is it going to be quicker to... I think it might be quicker to teleport back, actually. It tastes like lemonade a bit. Bullshit, John. <laughs> I don't believe you. Oh, I hate shots as well. I, I am notorious for hating shots. Because they're all disgusting. Like, people just do them for their, like, the, hey, let's do shots, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, no one, I don't think anyone actually does shots because they taste nice, do they? Maybe uh, which one you put on the white horse changes it something. I don't know because you could, I could, uh, the the white ones were going in easy. Now, now, don't say a word. Your days of shots are over. You can't do it anymore. Uh, I only tend to, get, uh, it only happens to me on birthdays. I find. Uh, my mates, they, they didn't have any Jaeger bombs, which is usually the only one I'll uh, maybe maybe go for. Um, so they it was tequila bombs instead. They were bad. It was bad times. Real bad times. <laughs> I know a guy who makes legit moonshine and legally, yes, but he can... Wait, legally? Illegally? Is it? You can make lemonade flavoured apple flavour cookie flavour. Hmm. Okay. Jello shots are good. Every jello shot I've tasted just tasted like shit jelly to me. <laughs> Tequila's kind of vile, it is, yeah. Je jelly's good. Je like bit of jelly, bit of ice cream. That's good. Like that. Uh, but yeah, jelly and alcohol mixed together just seems like crap. A crap idea to me. Oh no, John, don't get me wrong. Like, I like jelly. By the way, uh, we call Jello jelly over here because you call what you call jelly is jam, right? It's very confusing. I'm very confused. But yeah, jelly is nice, but alcohol jelly, bad. Remember getting very drunk on a birthday with jello shots? Not a good evening. What about alcoholic trifle? Fuck off, Reese. That's not a thing. Right? That's not a thing. 
That's not no, don't 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 bullshit me. That's 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 not a thing. Right, what's the boss? It's a floor monster. It's like nightmare. Hey dummy, need a hint? My weak point is Whoops, there I go talking too much again. Facade. We're gonna have to chuck uh, pots at it. Fuck you. I'll just block all these and see where it goes. Oh, okay, you're just gonna chuck everything at me. What? Wait, is there a time limit? What? Let's just try seeing, like, if I keep going. No, so you're just gonna randomly open holes. Maybe chuck bombs down the hole. Or just leave a bomb on its face. Oh, we didn't like that. It's funny, most most things don't really like bombs, do they? <laughs> actually hurting him though oh dear okay yeah no he's definitely hurting him because he's, he's doing loads more blocks yeah okay listen up if the windfish wakes up everything on this island will be gone forever and i do mean everything yay We can make it a thing? Oh, there's actually an alcohol trifle. What? Oh, uh, Mar I, I was wondering, you know what? I was wondering if anyone knew what Nightmare was. I used to love that uh, program back when I was younger. It used to freak me out a bit, though. Like, the wall monsters were, were kind of scary. Not just a unalcoholic trifle. Was it multiple alcohols? Oh, three alcohol trifle? Is that what that says? Nightmare was amazing. It was weird, though. Yeah, but, you know, weird's good. We got a, uh, a magical triangle. You got the coral triangle. Sweet. Mountain. Something calls from the mountains. Here's our owl friend. The many monsters of this island fear that the windfish is about to awaken. The monster's power is real. They may conquer the island and destroy their foes. That day may come soon. Now go to the mountain tower. Fly like a bird. Okay, well I've got to get that key first. So it's, uh, it's there. But I've got to get the key from there first. And I couldn't seem to find a way around. I've also not got... There's another item I'm missing. I don't know if it's this one down here. 
<clears throat> Three alcohol trifle sounds horrible, Reese. And you know what? I don't don't please don't hate me for this. I can't remember when I ha actually had a trifle last. Yeah, you know you know what it was that scared me about Nightmare? I think it was the um the music got really creepy when um like the characters were about to die. And, like you know that um like they showed how their uh, energy was depleting. I think the skeleton uh like dropping its armor used to scare me as well. A lot of things used to freak me out as a kid. <laughs> uh, let's see, I've got an hour hour and a quarter before we got to stop for anime night. So, um, I'll see if I can get that key. But I think I need to I, I need to try and figure out where the next part of this um, quest is for... Um, uh, like the trading quest. I, I'm not really sure where to go. 